everyone, welcome back to another Rapid Resizer tutorial. Today we're going to take a look at our new and improved crop tool. To start off, once you've signed in and chosen your design, I'm going to go to the design library and choose this glass pattern here. Go to use design and you can find the crop tool in the customize and resize page. So let's go to customize and then here you'll find crop. Cropping your design is one of the most important steps you can take to make sure that it prints accurately. So let's take a look at all the ways that you can customize your cropping. The first thing you will see at the top here is our slider zoom. This will enable you to bring the dotted line as close to your design as possible. I want to make sure that my outer edge of the design is included, so I'm just going to drag these lines to the top. As you can see, you can zoom in very closely to your design with the zoom. And you can make sure it's perfectly accurate. As well as using the slider, you can also pinch to zoom if you have a trackpad or if you have a mouse, you can use the control wheel to zoom in and zoom out. Next up, let's take a look at all the different shapes that we have here. The first shape cropping option we have is our rectangle, which is what we used earlier. Next to that, we have a circle. And beside that, we have our brand new half circle, which is a personal favorite of mine. And as you can see, you can change how much it's arching. Or you could just make it into the semicircle. And last but not least, we have our diamond. And again, all you have to do is just to drag this dotted line to wherever you would like it to be. Below our different shape cropping options, we have this button which is to select all of your design. And if we try it out on our rectangle, it's selected all of our design. And again with the circle, it's taken the line to the outer edge. If you decide you don't want to crop your image and you just want to go back, you can select cancel. Or if you decide that this is the crop that you would like, you can go to apply here. And there's my image perfectly cropped. Another new feature that we have added to the crop tool is the ability to go back and for the crop tool to remember your cropping selection. And we are back in the crop tool and it's remembered exactly how I wanted to crop. Let's try a different shape just so it's a little bit more obvious. Just as an example, let's go to command and back again. And as you can see, we still have our circle. And last but definitely not least, another new feature that we have is a dedicated user interface for phone users. As you can see here, you have all of the same cropping options as you did on the computer. You can cancel your crop, accept it, all, which is select all of the design. And then if we tap on shape, you can see all of the same shape selections. All you have to do is tap on the shape that you want and then just drag on your phone screen to how you would like it to be cropped. And here it is with the rectangle and then select all. And that's it for this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you enjoy using our new and improved crop tool.